In this video, we'll be showing you how to import shoes into vSitcher. First, we'll need a 3D model of a shoe. Shoes can be purchased or downloaded for free on different websites that focus on 3D models. Another option is to reach out to a 3D designer who can create custom-made shoes for you. Now that we have our shoes, let's start by opening up vSitcher. On the Resources tabs, click 3D and go to Closet. If it's not already in use, select Shoes from the drop-down list. Click on the hamburger icon and select Add Shoes. You can either import it as an FBX or OBJ file format. There must only be one shoe and not a whole pair in your 3D object, as the shoe will be mirrored on the avatar. The file can contain multiple objects and textures. In order to import shoes with correct orientation, when preparing the 3D object in external software, make sure that the top of the shoes are parallel to the y-axis. Click Open and the shoes are added to the closet. Remember that before importing the object to vStitcher, it is recommended to prepare the external assets in the same size as their real life size. You can swap your shoe's position if they're on the wrong foot in the context view. Next, we'll fit the shoes by using Gizmo in the 3D window. You can also change the values in the context view under 3D Transformations to change the position or size of your shoes. The shoes fit well. Let's save it. Now we'll add another pair of shoes. This time, it'll be a pair of high heels. Note that when importing high heel shoes, you'll have to edit the height of the avatar's heels in the context view under measurements. The high heels slider goes from zero to one. It allows you to fit many different styles of shoes. Let's repeat the steps for adding new shoes to our closet and fitting them on the avatar. If you are using a 3D model you found online, you may find that sometimes you won't be able to fit the shoes perfectly due to the difference between the avatar's foot and the shape of the shoe. In that case, a 3D specialist can export a vSitcher avatar and adjust the shoes accordingly in a third-party 3D software before importing to vSitcher. And there you have it, an easy way to import new shoes into vSitcher. To learn more about importing 3D objects, visit our Help Center at support.browseware.com.